Welcome back. back. Sorry, my mic was not plugged in. Um, so sorry about that. Uh, so welcome back to another discussion video slash a little bit of a, um, well, more discussion. But uh, today we're going to be talking about the uh, open world, open world uh, base kind of. Thing. Right. So uh, right now I'm playing an open world kind of thing, uh, in. Um, no, uh, I uh, in creative right now. Uh, sorry. Um, so you can see, like, uh, this is like basic open world stuff. You know, you got fishing, you got like all that kind of stuff. Um, but another question is, what about like, uh, what about like things like, um, uh, like, if you want to say like. If you want to play it solo, right? Right now I'm playing it solo, right? So I don't want to really play with anyone at, um, at the time. So the question is, is it going to be like that kind of thing? Uh, kind of thing where you get to play it as if you get get to choose if you want to play it uh, so solo or not. Also, if you notice that monsters only spawn at a specific area, they don't spawn, they don't spawn like, you know, because it, for example, this type of open world, right, you can see uh, the monsters only spawn in uh, a certain location. They don't spawn like in, um, what's it called, they don't spawn randomly, just like, uh, uh, they only spawn uh, near like areas that, uh, like for instance, if you see right there, you can see they only spawn right uh, over there. So, oops, like they only spawn there. So, um, like you can see, like there's corruption zones and stuff. Th that would be really great, like for an open world kind of. But, um, there's no Is it gonna come up? Nope. Okay. Uh, but, you know, like, people, if people want to play solo, they can. Uh, if people want to play it, uh, like, uh, if they want to play with, play, if they want to play with their friends, that's fine. You know, that's a thing also, you can play with your friends. Uh, so, um, uh, Like those, I haven't found meat crops. I only found like food crops, or maybe I have to join a clan in order to respect them. Because I think uh, I don't know what that is. Because I have to join a clan. I'm not sure how this is. So you can choose your clan, and then you can build up your nation. Also, that would be really cool if you can like recruit other members to join your uh, nation. But not like in like uh, not like uh, you know how you play PvP. No, not like that. I'm talking about like recruiting other members from like like say. Uh, I'll give an example of what would be a great example of this. Um, uh, I don't know. Uh, an anime that I recently watched was uh, that time I got reincarnated as slime. Would be a good example of what I mean. Like basically, you recruit other members, not like actual real players, but players like, um, like more or less, kind of like. I don't know how to say it. More or less, kind of, um, you know, you recruit a member, and then you, and then you, um, I mean, you, and then you build up your nation, or you build up your like, na yeah, nation or slash, uh, 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 nations, and then you, and then your, the your your members of your the the, and then you can fight other nations. 
uh, other like uh, like other like uh, nations, for example, like for like you want to fight against them, but that's only if you want to fight against them. But that's like if you don't want to fight against them, that's fine. So and there must be like a story. There must be a story. There has to be a story to it. So each character has to have a story. So like for another example, would be Gesh Impact, right? Gesh Impact is a very well known, uh, well known, uh, a well known uh, game. Uh, but like you could see, like I don't know how. To what was it gonna, I, anyways, but you know, recruiting other members, um, and there's like different, like di different types of world bosses, and uh, um, so, like world bosses. Uh, you might be wondering, what is a world boss? Well, world boss. There are two types of world bosses. I mean, there are two. Like, there's in this, like you see in this world, like world. There's only one type of world boss right here. There's only one type of world boss. If you t compare that to any other game, there should be like, if you say if Fortnite was to have a world boss, there should be multiple world bosses. So there should be like at least two or three, or like t like five, and then two, and then there's two like a couple bosses around the the world, right? Those are still world bosses, even though they're, they're bosses. Um, so like those, you can fight like those are kind of like world bosses, but you also get loot and stuff right you can get like different items like but also another example is not to use like things like you know like if it's if it's still there if like epic still uses like guns and stuff then it's not gonna be fun like like normally like when you look at open world you don't want guns you don't want guns you don't want like who like you want it to be more like a fantasy kind of game like, you, do you want an AR? Do you want it like that? Like, ugh, it still feels like Battle Royale. When you're playing Ganesh of Pact, you're like, you have a sword, you have a, like, different types of weapons, you have a sword, you have a, a spear, you also have a, uh, let's see, um, a spear, you also have, like, m you can use magic, uh, you can use, like, they're like a couple, like a couple of items that like different types of weapons for the, for those and a bow and arrow. So for example, you don't have to use like, like, like a, like guns and stuff. Like, like if you're playing like any game, like any open world, there's no such thing. As, like there's no guns in in open world. There's like none. Not no guns whatsoever. Even like to say I know. Like, I know that Breath of the Wild doesn't have guns, uh, Gators Impact doesn't have guns, none of those. They don't have guns whatsoever. They either use magic, uh, like spears or uh, lance, lances, um, a bow and arrow, a sword, uh, anything that does with magic items like a, like a, like a wand, or for example. Uh, any like magic, uh, you can use like hand magic also. That'll be a good example. Uh, what are the things? Uh, you know, just uh, just basically. Um, uh, let's see which one should I choose? Mm, let's choose. So. Okay. So. So I'm part of the Earth Clan, right? Uh, I think so. You are in the Earth Clan. Okay, so like, in the, uh, like, also you can build up your own nation, for example, um, as I mentioned, and like other things you can do. I'm trying to find where the Earth Clan is right there. I don't know why it has a white name, it should be in green. Uh, but, Anything like that would be a good sample of what. Um, what's this? Um, oh, that's a firefly. Oops, went the wrong way. <laughs> uh, but you know, like, and 
the way that open worlds also work is like you can build like other things like those like uh I can't say <laughs> uh, I'm just trying to think what else would they add. Um and also another thing is that don't focus on one specific character. Focus on multiple characters. Right? Don't focus on this character, don't focus on that character, focus on like like I maybe I should chose the ice clay because it's close to the fish fishing thing because it's water. Um, but it doesn't matter. Anyways. So. Um, just trying to think. What's this? Um, also you can find loot for open worlds, you know. Um, so this is the earth plan, right? The question is, I, I have a really good question here. My question is, how do they put drops, you know? Uh, for this open world thing. I should have chose, uh, you know what? I should have chose the ice climb because the ice climb would have been better because it's near the fishing area. Whatever. Anyways, uh, on topic of open, other open worlds, like, uh, so, just, just like, like you don't have to be. It doesn't have to be uh, PV. Like it doesn't have to be PVP uh, based. It can also be non PVP. And there should be also like a a, a section where the PV like the PVP is. Uh, there should be like a solo version of PVP, and there should be a, a non solo version of PVP. Uh, and then you, like if you want to go PVE like PVP. I mean, no, not P. What I'm talking about. If you want to just go with uh, PVE, but without players, that's fine. You can go solo, uh, but you know that depends on you. But also another thing is like, you know, like maybe there's like different types of uh, places you can go to, like to make your weapons even better. For example, like, like a, like a, like a, like a, like, a, like, like they. Like your sword, right? You can go to a blacksmith and they'll upgrade your weapons, right? Right now, the only reason why, uh, the only reason why, like, this game mode doesn't have, like, uh, it doesn't actually have a, um, doesn't actually, if it was, uh, because the, the only reason why this one has guns in it, because they haven't, Epic hasn't added the, added the, um, uh, haven't hasn't added the uh, new weapons like slash tools things like the uh, sledgehammer the uh, uh, other like weapons like a giant hammer uh, you know like use like different types of in open worlds you can find like and then also like it doesn't have to be like a, like using say the world assets you can also make your own type of assets like like you can make like for example make one that's really cool like a really cool weapon right or uh, I think it shows a really terrible spot for me to climb there's like an ice clan uh, I mean there's like water right there but I don't know also they have a uh, what's called this uh, thing right here where you can go and attack other clans, but, you know, personally, I don't like that. <clears throat> I'd rather than, I'm um, just, to, like, say, like, uh, I don't know, I just want to play the game, you know, just want to have fun, right? You don't have to... Also, I found a lot of this stuff, I don't know what this, is. I've got traps and stuff like that. I don't know what all this stuff does, but... The question is, what does it do? Okay, I'm just checking. Like the... 
I think you can go to like a special place where it's not somewhere. And you can even ask like different like uh different like uh like craft items, you know. Alright. Yeah, legendary, that's twine and that's so much stuff. Um we got all this, but I don't know what to do with that. We need 50 of those. Okay. Well, that's not going to be good. Uh, but while we're at it, the thing. I'm going to bring this back to the uh, actual... I don't know what this does. It's like orange. Um, okay. That's a fire clan. I just like, oh man, I don't know what, because normally I would just go in the lobby and just explain everything, right? And then uh, tell everyone to, oh yeah, I, the open world stuff, right? But, I don't know. This, for some reason, this, I don't know why this flag doesn't work. Oh, it's more stuff we'll do that. Um uh, what are things that I was trying to talk about? Uh so um Firstly if like I was just explaining everything what an open world does and how it works. Um Oh, that's a fire clan. Okay. So I don't know. Uh, but you know, you get the point, like you know, like Genish Impact, uh Breath of the Wild, all those kind of games. But it's cool. But don't focus on one character. Focus on multiple characters. Uh, same with like when you did with Save the World, right? You didn't focus on one character. You focus. And there were like little mini events, right? Those are the really cool things, like people like mini events. So, uh, that's another thing. So, I think I gotta go around the dungeon. Uh, oh, yeah, there's. No, yeah, there's better fishing spot. Really? Yep, better. Alright, let's check it. I'll just explain everything. Uh, what? You know. So, open world base is. Look at the mines. Ooh, a lot of stuff. Um, what? Well, you know, if you guys give me suggestions, like, what would you like to see in an open world kind of uh, thing? Personally, I would love to see, like, different types of world bosses and stuff. That would be a really great idea for, uh... Um, that would be a really great idea to have that. Also, build up your nation, for example. Like a really cool idea for that would be like building up your nation, building up your like, like building up your own like fortress or so forth, and then adding new members to your clan, adding new new members from the, like different places of the other nations, like recruiting, like the, uh, and then there's like other things like for these open worlds, like uh, for example, uh, like. Say, for example, you can, you can also, like, um, uh, in, in Genesh Impact, they have this thing called, uh, you can, uh, the Adventure Guild, the Adventure Guild, where you can join the Adventure Guild and, uh, start, like, like, say, like, for instance, like, you want to do something like that, that, 
that is a good idea to do also. So, like, join the adventure skills. Um, Things. Build up your nation, like recruit other members of your, like recruit other heroes or slash. And they don't have to be all human. Like, they could be like ogres, they could be like, you know, they could be goblins, they could be like other characters. Like, maybe even a dragon for them, for example. Like, what we, we never really had a dragon skin. Like, a human dragon. Like, an actual human. But, but it's a dragon. Basically. Uh, we have dragon. We have a dragon skin, but not an actual human dragon. Basically, what I mean is like still a human. Like he's like half a hu half human, half dragon. Basically, kind of like he transforms. He transforms into a full dragon, right? He transforms into a full dragon, but then he transforms back into a human. So kind of like that. If you watch like the uh, slime, uh, like the, the slime, the uh, slime anime series, you can you can give an example of what I'm talking about. Like, like like there are some characters who are also dragons, but they but they they transform uh, into humans. So so like that, and then uh, and then there's like maybe like different types of. Maybe there's like different types of dragons, like there could be a wind, there could be a storm dragon, there could be an ice dragon, there could be like a, a fire dragon, there could be a earth dragon, there could be a, uh, what other, like there could be a red emperor fire dragon, um, what else? You know, they, there could be a time, like a, and like you can use like different elements of magic, like magic would be a really good, I will, so, open world, you know, uh, like those kind of things, I want to talk about because I really like uh, to see uh, to, uh, Fortnite to add an open world. And then, like another thing would be a really good initiative for these open worlds is to allow you to save your data. So, for example, uh, right now you can save your data in uh, uh, in uh, in like save the world, but you can't save your data in. Um, like, what's it called? Uh, in, uh, you can save your data from in uh, within the creative with the save data thing, uh, pad thing, uh, and I'll pretty much save every day, like every like thing you did before. So before they didn't have that, but now they do. They have uh, the ability to save your data. Okay. So you don't have to worry about like uh, getting in like, oh like I forgot to save my data, you know, right? Or like those kind of things. I'm just giving an example of what I mean. Ah, oh, this fish is broken. Yeah, so, um, what other things? Also, make the world a much like I heard some rumors that uh, so if you guys remember that old like uh, map that I mentioned a couple a while ago, where like that was supposed to be rumored to be the chapter three map. However, I think I think uh, someone proclaimed that it was going to be a lot bigger. I don't know where from, but that's where I heard it from. Uh, but I don't know. Some people are saying it's going to be a lot more bigger, so we'll see how big it's going to be. Let's uh, let's hope it's going to be a lot more bigger and less water mass, you know? Because I would love to see less water mass. Oh, yeah, sorry. Uh, this is not a pit. And like, you know, use different, like as you can see, there's like, uh, see, when you go in the water, right, there's only like, you can only see floppers and uh, surfish. Right? But you can't see other fish. Right? So, like, for example, there should be, like, there should be, like, different types of fish. And also, another thing, another example is that fish shouldn't, like, it shouldn't be this easy to catch fish. Okay? 
I, I, I'm just not happy with this fishing, uh, uh, fishing. It should have been more like actual real fishing. So, if you do, if you know what actual real fishing like in the open world, they use actual real fishing instead of like, like, I don't know. You just throw your fishing rod and you catch yourself a fish. No, no, that's not how. That's not. That's not. That's not how you do it. That's not how you do it. You do it like uh, you. You do it like an actual real. You're you're actually really catching a fish. Like you, throw your fishing rod out. Wait until the fish like the, you like the fish like swim up, swim up, uh, try to, and use like different types of bait, right? So that's more like a, an open world kind of. Uh, another idea for an open world they should use like different types of bait where the fishing doesn't actually where the fishing doesn't actually like you know just follow your fishing rod and just like catch your fish right and then you just like automatically catch a fish right? this one i mean there is patience but it's not really that patient like it's only like three or four seconds long. like so if i throw my fishing rod out right here right i already caught a fish simple as that like fishing holes, it shouldn't be this easy. It shouldn't be this easy. It should have been more. Uh, there should have been like a, a patient. Like the fish would just like, like you throw your fishing rod out, right? And then the fish would like. I can't really show you in the screen, but the fish would, the fish would come over and then just like, like would start sniffing your bait and then just maybe, ow, and then uh, and then grab it and then like tug it, like tug it really hard and just pulling your fish out and you gotta reel up and then you gotta use your like special like there should be like a monitor, like a like a speed monitor where it says like it tells you how much like like the, how, the, how strong the fish is you know I mean personally I am a fisherman myself so I, 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 definitely, I definitely use like uh, I definitely want to have uh, fishing to be more more advanced than the uh, actual, like the fishing that's in Battle Royale right now. It should, it, it should be more like, oh yeah, like, you gotta real catch it, you gotta, like, really, <coughs> like, coughing, you gotta reel in, you know, you gotta, like, use your rod, and then you gotta, like, you know, like, if you, like, you gotta reel in, you can't just, like, oh, I'm just gonna throw my fishing rod, I'm just gonna catch my fish in two seconds, right? You gotta, like, it has to, the fish has to come up, and grab your, like, grab your, you know, it has to be, it has to be more exciting. Like, fishing can't just be like, oh, you know, no, it, bro, it has to be more exciting. And like, it has to be like, oh, I almost got it, bro. I almost got this fish, you know? That's why, that's why, like, uh, that's why fishing super, you know, some people might find it boring, but when you get the fish, it's like, oh my god, I got the fish, I got fish. You know, you gotta reel up, and that's what, uh, that's what, I know it's like, I'm making it really sound like super exciting, but it is, it is like, it is what I'm talking about. Like, that should be like, more like, what an open world should have. Like, the fishing should be more extreme instead of like, oh, I'm gonna throw my fish around, oh, wait, five seconds later, fish, you know? It's almost like, uh, what's it called, uh, if you go to Newfoundland, right, if, you, if anyone goes to Newfoundland, right, uh, you can just like, throw your rod out there, and it's just like, oh man, I caught myself a fish. So, fishing should be more, more extreme. It should be more like real fishing, like not like this cheap, like I don't know, cheap thing. Like just throwing your rod out and just gonna get myself a fish, cut the fish right here, here, and here. No, it has to be like these patient, that's the patience. There's patience involved. There's also a lot of cost. A lot of concentration, you know, it, it takes, and you can't scare the fish away, you can't scare the fish away, so, <laughs> see, if you throw, like, so that should be a thing, like, when you throw your fish rod, then you don't scare the fish away, right? And that's what I'm saying, it shouldn't be that simple, it should be more like, oh, you know, I almost got it, oh, I missed it, you know? So that's what, and also, you know, another thing, good uh, example is dynamic, uh, dynamic uh, weather changing, in uh, if uh, if an open world uh, happens, 
like for instance like different areas like how like give example of minecraft for example right uh you can see like there's different weather changes right like say there's gonna be a, like like simple it's just a simple weather change like rain snow those are the two weather changes that you just need to do for an open world you just need like say like uh you know like like a couple days for like a few days for that where there's like oh it's gonna be raining you know so those are the things that you want to look for also uh, but you have to like, there has to be like different types of weather changes also so it can't be like oh there's gonna be a storm coming in no 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 it has to be more like oh yeah there's there's rain, snow, and other things. So, for instance, like maybe there's like a, a rainstorm going on, right? Um, or like there's gonna be like a snowstorm, like a snowstorm like in the up in the mountains. It's gonna be a much snowier. Well, <laughs> I, as a, <laughs> it's gonna be much snowier. <laughs> I just got like that idea because. Uh, but an example of those, and and also if Epic was going to do like, like I would love to see the map to be more like a more of a, a generic like like more like like there there's more experience on the map like you can go like there's like there's gonna be mountains like different types of mountains and stuff right like there's a cliff mountain there's a uh, a small little uh, small mountain. Uh, like, see, like, there's, like, you can see there, there's, like, hills and stuff, but that's, like, you want, like, different, you want more mountains, you want to make it more, like, oh, now this is cool, you know, and different biodiversity also, another good example, I talked about biodiversity, it's coming to Minecraft, Ooh. I would love to see that in Fortnite, too, also, uh, so, when, maybe when the chapter 3 map does come out, uh, a lot of people are speculating it will come out. I'm thinking it will because some uh, some people might think of it, but uh, but I believe that eh, I think they're almost like really like just about to finish up. Yeah. So you know, personally, they want to make it really they want to make it super perfect for the chapter three map. So I'm just like just saying like all the things you know the chapter three map. I think personally, the chapter three map is going to be a lot more better gonna have a lot more diversity around the map there's gonna be a lot more hills on the map you know more like hill mountains like big mountains but they don't have snow on it um, there's gonna be a lot more like you know just like different types of there's gonna be like different types of, of uh, like you might have a snowy mountain you might have a you might have a what's called the um, you might have a snowy mountain, you might have a cliffy mountain, you might have a, a you know, you saw that, like, you saw that rumored, uh, map, right? It's a, it's a, it's a very well made map, also, very well made. Uh, they made it, he made it really well, he, I really liked it, because he added, like, so much, like, there was so much to look at. There was, like, there was different cliffs, there were, like, mountains, there were, like, like different hills, there were like hilly, much hillier mountains. Uh, there was like snowy mountains. There were like so much stuff. Like, you know, the the rough draft just le felt like a little too cluttered, right? And if she had like, if she had like things like, like uh, another good example. Remember we saw on the map there was like tiny little villages, right? If they should add that to the chapter two map, right? So I'm just like explaining what, like. What good example of what that map showed us? It was super. It was super well made. It just felt like, oh, now this is the map I want to go to. I want to just like explore the whole map. But it just felt really small, personally. I know it's a lot bigger, but, uh, but, you know, personally, if it was, if, if the map was a lot more bigger, oh, sorry, um, then it would be a lot more. Uh, like, like, 
you know, more like the map is going to be like, there's more hills, there's more things, what, what, you know, and also leave down in the comments down below, what would you like to see on the chapter 3 map? You know, the chapter 2 map will happen, um, not, 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 not next year, but this year, coming this year, coming to your new Fortnite team. coming this year, the chapter 3 map might happen, who knows? But we're still, it's just some people are still speculation, but I believe, from my personal opinion, I believe that the chapter 2 map will happen uh, in sometime in the near future. And it will probably happen right, because there are so much teasers for the chapter 3 map. I just, and I really think that the chapter 3 map is going to be the best out of all the other maps. Uh, you know, and they also said that they might use some old as uh, assets from the chapter one map. Uh, maybe I don't know. I mean, it does sound pretty cool, but I don't know. So, you know, I like uh, I mean that would kind of cool. But I heard this from like some uh, source. Uh, I mean, not source, uh, but I heard from a uh, news channel, and uh, I was like, "Ooh, wow! There's a lot of things to talk about." Ooh. I want to talk about this, I want to talk about that. Um, but yeah, while we were on top of the, the open world stuff, I was also talking about the uh, Battle Royale side of things. So, um, now the question is, is the open world going to be free? Yes, of course, everything is free. Like, <laughs> they don't want to make everything paid for. The only thing that they want is the V-Bucks. Because that's the only thing that, and I believe that if, if I had to make a guess, I, oh, I forgot. I, I should have it today too because I was about to sell that. Um, if I was gonna make a guess, um, let's see. Oops. If I was gonna make a guess, um, what like things would uh, possibly, um, what what Epic's plan is? Uh, you know, you saw some things like some hints towards the, some plans. They might, there might be some changes here and there, but I don't know. Like they did plan for chapter, uh, uh, but you know, I was, I was sort of speculating that chapter two, season nine was gonna happen, but I still, like, when I first thought about it, I think Gabriel, like the, the best guy in the world, who's the best, um, but he hasn't talked about like what's gonna happen in chapter 3 map. He only said that, like, the only, the only thing he said was, um, that we, he thinks that we are going to go into the chapter 3 map. And I believe him, because one thing is that he's always correct. He's always correct. Just trust me. Because no other person I have seen so far, um, has that, like, accurate. And just like, and the, also there was a lot of information about the black hole that will return. So, just saying, chapter 3 map, I'm hoping that there's going to be a lot more biome diversity and there's going to be a lot more experiences and a lot more things. Uh, so, we were talking about a lot of things, so it was about 30 minutes, 30 minutes, like 38 minutes long. I'm sorry, I apologize for this uh, video for a long time. Uh, you gotta watch the full to the end, um, but yeah, I apologize for the whole, like, I just wanted to talk about, like, a lot of things, and there were, like, a lot of things I want to talk about. So, uh, basically, open world kind of thing, what, so I want you guys to think about what the comic is going to be, and what the whole map's going to be. I believe that the map is going to be a lot more diverse in the whole thing. I like a lot of people really, really want to see more diversity in the map. Because in the chapter three, in the chapter three map, eh, there was not a lot of diversity. Um, in the chapter one map, there was a lot of diversity, but there was not a lot of uh, like cliffs and uh, you know, like how do I explain it? it was there was not a lot of uh, things like uh, cliffs and other stuff, you know. So. Who knows? Um, I expect the world. I'm just really excited. I'm really excited to see what the 
support our chapter through the hands of the sword for us. Uh, uh, that's it's just like I'm just I don't know. It's just like it's. I think it's just like going to be really amazing. I just I just have this feeling like oh yeah now that's I pick up all these fish. Uh, but I hope the epic makes the fishing a little bit more like intense instead of like super like boring and stuff. So it should be more intense instead of uh, less intense. Uh, because you know this because that's why I didn't like fishing and so far because uh, fishing found fishing in Fortnite just a little too boring <laughs> in my personal opinion. Oh, we only have three. Okay. Oh. Alright. So, open world. Um. Open world, other things. Uh, maybe different fish, you know. Also, fish do grants with different abilities. That's really cool about Fortnite. They add, they add different abilities. Um, but, you know, fish don't really grant like superpowers. <laughs> like, I've never seen a fish grant superpowers before. In my entire life. Never in an open world before. So, maybe they'll, maybe they'll change it up to where they see, like, maybe they'll change it so the fish don't grant superpowers because. I don't know where would you use like where would you use a fish for fish powers? <laughs> would you use your, would you use the fish for like looking up something? I don't know. Like personally, I don't think uh, you need the fish to have super powers. Maybe just to use the normal fish, right? Like like a small uh, like a flopper, right? Or something. Or like a small fry. Small fry. Uh, what other fish? Um, the uh, what's that fish called again? Um, the giant, the giant fish, the the one with the the big chungus. I'm not talking about that one. Um, catfish, right? Catfish, right? We have catfish, but they're not like the rift fish. There are catfish, but they're not like yeah. And there was a lot of, so, I don't know what, you know, I'm just really excited also. We saw like Bloom and Blossoms, you know, I would love that, that would be like my personal, that would probably be my personal favorite out of all of them. If they remove that, I'm going to be like super disappointed. They better not remove Bloom and Blossoms because, Bloom and Blossoms because, you know, I was just like, nope, I'm not playing this, I'm not playing this game anymore. They didn't add Bloom and Blossoms. But I would love to see it. If they didn't add the glaciers, nope. I'm, I'm leaving. They didn't add the glaciers. They didn't add Mansion. Nope. I'm not playing the Mansion. Also, I know that I'm talking a lot. I'm sorry. It's just like, it's just like there's a lot to explain. So, big video. Alright, I hope you guys do enjoy this little quick, uh, this uh, 43, uh, 43 minutes long video. <sighs> I've been talking a lot. Oh man, I need a break. Uh, I talked about the open world. I haven't like it has to start with like I like it sounds like a bunch of gibberish, right? I know you guys sound like oh man, this sounds like a bunch of gibberish, right? Yeah, it does. Hey, what's going on, guys? <laughs> uh, maybe I should have done a stream instead. All right, I hope you guys do enjoy this video slash uh, little discussion video on the open world slash. Uh, the chapter three map. Uh, so, um, yeah, uh, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.